ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಹರಿ ಓಂ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಒಂದೇ ಮಂತಪಾಶಧರಂ ದಿವ್ಯಾರ್ಭಕೃತಿ ಶಿಖಾಬಂಧತ್ರೋಪೇತ ಭೈಷ್ಮೀಮಧ್ವಕರಾರ್ಚಿತ ಟಾಪಿಕ್ ಈಸ್ ಸೈಂಟಿಫಿಕ್ ಇಂಟರ್ಪ್ರಿಟೇಷನ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಮೆಡಿಟೇಟಿವ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಗಾಯತ್ರಿ ಲೆಟ್ಸ್ ಈ ದ ಶ್ಲೋಕ ದೇವ್ ಸದಾ ಸವಿತ್ರ ಮಂಡಲ ಮಧ್ಯವರ್ತಿ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಸರಸಿಜಾಸನ ಸನ್ನಿವಿಷ್ಟ ಕೇಯುರವಾನ್ ಮಕರಕುಂಡಲವಾನ್ ಕಿರೀಟಿ ಹಾರಿ ಹಿರಣ್ಮಯವಪುರ್ ಧೃತಶಂಕ ಚಕ್ರ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಮೆಡಿಟೇಟ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಇಂಡ್ವೆಲ್ಲರ್ ಆಫ್ ಸನ್ ನಾರಾಯಣ ದ ಒನ್ ಹೂ ಈಸ್ ಸಿಟ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಕಂಫರ್ಟಬಲ್ ಆರ್ ಪದ್ಮಾಸನ ಪೋಶ್ಚರ್ ಹೀ ಈಸ್ ವೇರಿಂಗ್ ಅಪ್ಪರ್ ಆಮ್ ಕಫ್ ಸೆಮಿ ಸರ್ಕ್ಯುಲರ್ ಶೇಪ್ಡ್ ಇಯರಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಕ್ರೌನ್ ನೆಕ್ಲೆಸ್ ಹೀ ಈಸ್ ಇನ್ ಗೋಲ್ಡನ್ ಕಾಂಪ್ಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಹೋಲ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಕಾನ್ಚ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಡೆಸ್ಕ್ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ನಿಖಿಲಪೂರ್ಣ ಗುಣೈಕ ದೇಹಂ ಫುಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಕ್ವಾಲಿಟೀಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ವೈಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಡಿಫೆಕ್ಟ್ಸ್ ನರರು ನೃಗತ ದೋಸ್ ಹೂ ಪೊಸೆಸ್ ನಾಲೆಜ್ ಆರ್ ಆಸ್ಪಿರೇಷನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಸ್ಟೇಸ್ ಇನ್ ನರ ಈಸ್ ನಾರ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಜ್ಞಾನ ನಾಲೆಜ್ ಜ್ಞಾನದಿಂದ ಈಯತೆ ಜ್ಞಾಯತೆ ಇತಿ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಇಸ್ ದ ಒನ್ ಹೂ ಈಸ್ ವಿಸಿಬಲ್ ಟು ನಾಲೆಜಬಲ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಆಸ್ಪಿರೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಆರ್ ಸಮ್ ಸ್ಪೆಷಲ್ ಫೀಚರ್ಸ್ ಮೆನ್ಷನ್ಡ್ ಟು ಪರ್ಸೀವ್ ದ ಗಾಡ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಕೇಯುರವಾನ್ ಮಕರಕುಂಡಲವಾನ್ ಕಿರೀಟಿ ಹಾರಿ ಹಿರಣ್ಮಯವಪುರ್ ಶಂಕ ಚಕ್ರ ಕೇಯುರವಾನ್ ಅಪ್ಪರ್ ಆಮ್ ಕಫ್ ಕೇಯುರವಾನ್ ಸಿಗ್ನಿಫೈಸ್ ದಿ ಅಪ್ಪರ್ ಆಮ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋನ್ ಫಾರ್ ಸ್ಟ್ರೆಂತ್ ಆರ್ ಫೋರ್ಸ್ ಲೆಟ್ ಸಿ ವಾಟ್ ಡಸ್ ದಿ ಅಪ್ಪರ್ ಆಮ್ ಕಫ್ಸ್ of sun's indweller indicates sun is a thermonuclear fusion reactor fusion is merger of small nuclei into heavier ones releasing tremendous amount of energy in the process of converting hydrogen to helium hydrogen nuclei are positively charged protons proton proton do not fuse easily because of fundamental fact coulomb repulsion which is like charges ripple each other nuclear fusion is possible only when repulsion between protons are overcome for this to happen energy and temperature at the sun core should be substantially high but it happens at much lower temperature than that required to overcome coulomb repulsion strong nuclear force binds two protons together and it is stronger by minimum 100 times to the coulomb repulsion force kayuravan is the quality or feature of god that signifies the strong nuclear force which overcomes coulomb repulsion for nuclear fusion makarakundalavan semi circular shaped earrings earrings signifies the importance of ear and ear is the indication of balance the semicircular canals in the vestibular system of ear balances the outer and inner ear pressure to fetch stability balance and equilibrium to body let's see what does the semicircular shaped earrings of sun's indweller indicates the mutual gravitational attraction between the masses of various regions within sun produces tremendous forces that tend to collapse the sun towards its center that means attraction of outer layers by the inner ones towards center to balance the pressure of inner layers all forces within the sun are balanced and hence sun is stable without expanding or contracting this is due to hydrostatic equilibrium achieved between the self gravity of the sun and the thermal pressure generated by fusion in the core makarakundala is the quality or feature of god that signifies the hydrostatic equilibrium to balance all forces for stability kiriti crown crown signifies the head brain is the important part of head and it is self regulated control center let's see what does the crown of sun's indweller indicates if the amount of energy produced by nuclear reactions in the core of sun is not sufficient to match the energy radiated away at the surface the sun will then lose energy 
with low energy feedback sun will contract a bit as the core contracts it heats up a bit the pressure increases and the nuclear energy generation rate increases until it matches the energy required by the luminosity similarly if the star over produces energy in the core the excess energy will heat the core increasing the pressure and allowing the star to do work against gravity the core will expand and cool a bit and the nuclear energy generation rate will decrease until it once again balances the luminosity requirement of the sun this can only be achieved from sun's self gravitational energy kirita is the quality or feature of god that signifies the self regulated control of sun to achieve required performance hari necklace necklace signifies the communication pathways in the neck the brain stem and spinal cord joint in the neck facilitates and regulates bidirectional communication between brain and body let's see what does the necklace of sun's indweller indicates for regulation of energy bidirectional communication happens between sun's core and its surface sun's various layers rotates at different speed when the angular momentum of photons are obtained by moving plasma it works as mild breaking force reducing the plasma rotational speed this mild breaking force is more effective at places where density is less that means it is more effective at poles than equator hence solar rotational period at equator is around 24 to 25 days and 35 to 36 days at poles this is called as differential rotation the outer layers from the core rotates at the rate of 10% less than each of its previous layer density pressure temperature and speed all are interrelated the outer layer should rotate at specific rate to meet the required luminosity if the outer rotational speed decreases photon ejection rate increases to intensify the luminosity when luminosity is intensified the nuclear reactions in the core reduces till it matches the required luminosity if the outer rotational speed increases photon ejection rate decreases such that the luminosity is also decreased when luminosity is decreased the nuclear reaction rate increases till it matches the required luminosity hara is the quality or feature of god that signifies the regulation of energy production through bidirectional communication between core and surface hiranmayopur golden color color signifies the wavelength and energy of light let's see what does the color of sun's indweller indicates electromagnetic radiations coming out of sun with 400 nanometer to 780 nanometer wavelength is said to be visible light there are seven colors in visible light and they are violet indigo blue green yellow orange and red the wavelength of violet is 400 nanometer and wavelength of red is 780 nanometer anything less than 400 nanometer and above 780 nanometer is said to be in the invisible range of human eyes wavelength is indirectly proportional to energy the average visible light wavelength of 400 nanometer to 780 nanometer is 590 nanometer which is in between range being neither intense nor poor 590 nanometer wavelength indicates yellowish orange or gold color having photon energy of 2.1 electron volt the solar constant value is 1360 watt per meter square and earth receives about 340 watt per meter square in the incoming 340 watt per meter square around 29% or 99 watt per meter square is reflected back to space around 23% or 78 watt per meter square is absorbed by earth's atmosphere and around 48% or 
ஹண்ட்ரட் சிக்ஸ்டி த்ரீ வேட் பர் மீட்டர் ஸ்கொயர் ஈஸ் அப்சார்ப்டு பை சர்ஃபேஸ் ஆஃப் அர்த் அவுட் ஆஃப் அப்சார்ப்டு ஒன் சிக்ஸ்டி த்ரீ வேட் பர் மீட்டர் ஸ்கொயர் பை சர்ஃபேஸ் அரௌண்ட் எயிட்டி ஃபைவ் வேட் பர் மீட்டர் ஸ்கொயர் இஸ் சென்ட் பேக் இன் த ஃபார்ம் ஆஃப் எவாப்பரேஷன் செவன்டீன் வேட் பர் மீட்டர் ஸ்கொயர் சென்ட் பேக் இன் த ஃபார்ம் ஆஃப் கன்வெக்ஷன் ஆர் கண்டக்ஷன் அண்ட் அரௌண்ட் ஃபிஃப்டி எயிட் வேட் பர் மீட்டர் ஸ்கொயர் இஸ் சென்ட் பேக் ஆஸ் நெட் தர்மல் ரேடியேஷன் வித் திஸ் த அர்த் சென்ட்ஸ் பேக் த கம்ப்ளீட் ரிசீவ்ட் ஆர் அப்சார்ப்டு எனர்ஜி ஆஃப் ஒன் சிக்ஸ்டி த்ரீ வேட் பர் மீட்டர் ஸ்கொயர் வென் த இன்கமிங் அண்ட் அவுட் கோயிங் எனர்ஜி ஃப்ளக்ஸ் இஸ் பேலன்ஸ்ட் த அர்த் இஸ் செட் டு பீன் ரேடியேட்டிவ் ஈக்குவலிபிரியன் விச் கீப்ஸ் தி கிளைமேட் சிஸ்டம் ரிலேட்டிவ்லி ஸ்டேபிள் சப்போஸ் இஃப் த லைட் கமிங் அவுட் ஆஃப் சன் இஸ் க்ரீன் வித் வேவ் லென்த் ஆஃப் ஃபைவ் ஹண்ட்ரட் அண்ட் டென் நானோமீட்டர் அண்ட் இட்ஸ் ஃபோட்டான் எனர்ஜி பீயிங் டூ பாயிண்ட் ஃபோர் எலக்ட்ரான் ஓல்ட் there will be increase of 15% energy release by sun which directly increases the solar constant value earth's incoming energy evaporation convection and net thermal radiation energy by minimum 15% it will be 25% increase for blue color 45% increase for violet and 25% decrease for red in the first instance with increase in incoming energy earth's temperature increases resulting in high evaporation high evaporation results in water vapor concentration in greenhouse gas resulting in trapping the heat coming out of earth's surface when the outgoing heat is trapped it further heats up the atmosphere as well as surface resulting in more evaporation and this continues till earth loses radiative equilibrium If Earth's receiving energy is more than radiating energy, it ends up in drastic global warming. And if Earth's receiving energy is less than radiating energy, it ends up in global cooling. According to a research, if the sun's energy is increased by 10%, it can heat the Earth quickly and dry up everything. If the sun's energy is reduced by 10%, entire planet can be freezed. Hiranmayopur is the quality or feature of god that signifies the regulation of energy or wavelength of radiated light for maintaining radiative equilibrium shanka conch conch converts wind energy to sound energy and hence conch indicates conversion or transformation let's see what does the conch of sun's indweller indicates hydrogen hydrogen fusion happens in sun four atoms of hydrogen convert to one helium atom and hence hydrogen is converted to helium the mass of helium atom is 0.7% less than fused hydrogen atoms and the difference of 0.7% in mass releases energy hence mass is converted to energy when solar energy reaches earth it facilitates photosynthesis and light energy is converted to chemical energy in photosynthesis two water molecules are split in plants and is converted as oxygen gas with the help of chemical energy converted from light energy in the first stage of photosynthesis carbon dioxide is converted to carbohydrates in the second stage of photosynthesis shanka is the quality or feature of god that signifies the conversion or transformation of energy from one form to other chakra disk chakra signifies circulation and recycling let's see what does the chakra or disk of sun's indweller indicates the energy produced by sun is circulated in the space to reach various objects proton proton chain occurs in sun in that four protons fuse to become one helium atom and releases two protons those two protons released are recycled continuously in proton proton chain to produce energy sun's energy in circulation activates photosynthesis in which carbohydrates fat and proteins are produced all living beings depend on this for energy when the products of photosynthesis that is oxygen and carbohydrates are consumed it enters blood and gets circulated throughout the body 
chakra is the quality or feature of god that signifies the recycling and circulation of energy and its products until now we have seen the divine design and regulation in sun now let's understand the reason for meditation of this form first we should meditate for the knowledge to understand the design of god in sun second whatever is designed and regulated inside the sun is also applicable to humans and let's see how kura 1 force required to overcome repulsion female egg and male sperm are individual cells and with fusion of both cells it turns out to be fertilized zygote our life process begins with fusion cell fusion is necessary for growth of multicellular organisms and fusion plays a vital role in forming various types of cells and tissues fusion is important event in cell maturation and because of this the cells perform their specific functions throughout the growth there is repulsion between the fusion of cells and it requires fusion competence to overcome that repulsion without which fusion is not possible kairavan is the quality or feature of god that overcomes the fusion repulsion makara kundala hydrostatic equilibrium living cells lose equilibrium because of molecular motors and enzymatic process activities this process results in cytoplasm fluctuations caused due to ever present thermal agitation the small difference in cell volume and pressure serves as main signal for cell proliferation cell death and cell migration cell membrane tension is regulating factor for cell volume and shape intracellular fluctuations and cell membrane tension is regulated by hydrostatic equilibrium makara kundala is the quality or feature of god that signifies the hydrostatic equilibrium to balance all forces for stability kirita self regulated control center nucleus is called as brain of cell because it holds the required controlled information to perform and regulate cell functions like energy production structural support growth transportation reproduction through feedback process rate of production of atp adenosine triphosphate is dependent on the cell metabolism if the metabolic rate increases atp production also increases if metabolic rate reduces then atp production rate will also be reduced nucleus controls and regulates the atp production rate through gene transcription kirita is the quality or feature of god that signifies self regulated control of nucleus to run smooth cell metabolism hara bidirectional communication pathways communication in the spatially distant cellular compartments will be bidirectional flow of information the pores in the nucleus membrane facilitates and regulates bidirectional communication or flow between nucleus and other organelles from nucleus to organelles communication happens through mrna and organelles to nucleus happens through coded proteins hara is the quality or feature of god that signifies the facilitation and regulation of bidirectional pathways for communication or flow of information hiranmaya vapor optimum wavelength our cells produce biophotons which are invisible to our eyes in spite of being invisible the wavelength of these biophotons are said to be between 200 nanometer to 950 nanometer as per neural regeneration research they are also said to be in optical spectrum range by few researchers it is believed that biophotons are main regulating factor for all life processes science states the direct relation between biophotons and cellular metabolism in that case if the energy of biophotons increases it leads to hypermetabolism if energy reduces it is hypometabolism hyper and hypometabolism leads to variations in respiration blood circulation cell growth body temperature brain functioning etc the biophotons ranges between 
nanometer to 950 nanometer and the average wavelength of bio photon is 575 nanometer which indicates yellow or gold color these invisible bio photons can be seen or measured using sophisticated sensitive instruments like photomultiplier hence there are every possibility to see this bio photons from the subtle and sensitive inner eye hiranmayopur is the quality or feature of god that signifies the regulation of energy or wavelength of radiated light for maintaining optimal metabolic rate and cell homeostasis shanka conversion or transformation cells convert food energy into atp adenosine triphosphate which is usable form of energy for cells atp is converted to adp adp is adenosine diphosphate and vice versa in atp production activity oxygen is converted to carbon dioxide in protein production dna is converted to rna shanka is the quality or feature of god that signifies the conversion or transformation of energy from one form to other chakra recycling and circulation to carry out cellular functions atp is produced in mitochondria is circulated to all intracellular organelles in atp production stage already produced atp nadh and fadh is recycled to produce more energy like one glucose molecule produces 36 atp proteins are produced by circulation of atps excess or unused proteins are recycled to conserve energy chakra is the quality or feature of god that signifies the recycling and circulation of energy and its products the ornaments and weapons of god are his qualities which signifies his action and regulation behind every activity understanding the meditative form and holding it in the meditation gives rise to right and befitting stimulus with which life process and cellular functions can be efficiently regulated and that is why the meditative form has such potent significance now we can realize how profound our scriptures are indeed it is an eye opener for us to realize them as profound spiritual signs understanding the profoundness of the spiritual signs is not only the essence of philosophy but also a gift for every individual to perceive god's finest engineering this meditative form as described in narasimha purana not only unveils the working principle of sun and living cells it emphasizes the design and regulation of divinity behind it in fact the works of shri vedavyasa stands as citation for the entire gamut of signs at all times and period provided we understand them properly when most of the thinkers doubted puranas it was shri madhvacharya who explained sanctity of puranas through citations in his works with my heartfelt salutations to the scientific philosopher shri madhvacharya and his indweller lord shri krishna to bestow the knowledge and devotion to understand the divine engineering within us and around us i am signing off thank you krishna arpanamastu krishnam vande jagat gurum 